Hey, what's up, guys? It's Gray here, and um, I have a tutorial on color correction. But uh, before I start, I'd like to say that I'm sorry if my mic is uh, it's kind of weird and it's kind of staticky and stuff. But I'm just using a rock band mic and uh, trying to save up to buy an iMac or a new computer, an Apple computer, or maybe build my own computer. I don't know. But once I buy that, if I buy an iMac, it comes in with a built-in mic already. But if I just build my own computer, I'll buy like a better mic or something. But yeah, I'm just trying to save up money and I'm making some presets that I can sell, some intro presets. So look forward to that in a little bit. But um, yeah, let's get started with this tutorial. And this tutorial is uh, how to create a nice Black Ops color correction. And um, I'll show you guys a preview like at the end, I guess. Uh, I'll show like the video or whatever. And uh, yeah, let's just open up After Effects, go to File, Import, and Import File. And you're going to want to import your clip, of course. And I already have a clip on my desktop. It's by my friend Maniac. Uh, I'm sorry if I'm like, yeah, but I have a cold, so I'm kind of sick as well. But yeah, let's just import the clip. And once you import it, you get a new composition or whatever. Um, Alright, so then you're going to want to go to Effect and go to color correction and this is not using magic bullet some people have asked me to make a tutorial with uh, using magic bullet and uh, I have some already some tutorials already but I'm gonna uh, upload that after uh, this one and it's gonna be kind of the same color correction thing but it's more editable and more to your preferences and likings or whatever but yeah color correction and then you're gonna wanna go to curves and you wanna change this to red pick this one up like where the first cube is pick it up a little bit like maybe one third of the square and the bottom one right here I want to drop that about the same amount and you already get something nice right there and then go to green and do the same for green there you go you're getting something kind of nice now maybe more smooth you kind of want it to look pretty smooth and a nice curve and the blue you're gonna want to do the opposite so lift the top one up and the bottom one down something like that it's almost kind of too much yeah something like that and then the RGB I forgot to do the RGB do the same for the RGB something like that Alright, so you have that already. And then what I usually do is just hold, con uh, highlight your clip, hold controls, and then hit control C and control V. That would duplicate your clip. And then you just want to click this and put it to hard light. And uh, you want to hit T on your keyboard. This will bring down the opacity layer adjustment. And then put this to about 70 or something. Lower it all to your likings, whatever you like. Try to get something better. It's kind of how it looks. And then what you can also do is on the same layer, the one with the lowered opacity and the hard light, uh, you can also put go to comp uh, effect, color correction, and hue and saturation. And sometimes I lower this down and get something nice like that. That's the difference. Just a little bit darker, but it looks nice. It all depends on your theme and the music you're using, I guess. And you can do a lot more, add more effects. But that's basically it for this. And it's a nice little easy color correction. I'm not sure if you would use it for montages, maybe for episodes, maybe for montages. Nice little montages or something like that. But yeah, that's basically it. Something really easy to do, and it looks pretty nice. So here's a preview of it. And I hope you enjoyed it. Please don't forget to rate, comment, and subscribe. Wait, actually, I just thought of something. I cannot upload the preview because it shows gameplay. Or actually, you know what? I don't give a fuck. I'll do it. <laughs> but all right, I'll, I'll uh, upload the preview after this. So yeah, make sure you comment, rate, and subscribe. And um, I'm also accepting uh, orders and payments for intros and backgrounds. I know I haven't been accepting some for like the past month or two. But, uh, yeah, I'm now starting to accept some. So if you want to buy an intro or background, send me a message and we'll talk about that or whatever. But, yeah.
Talk to you guys later. Bye.